every day we encounter thousands, even millions of germs. Most are harmless and some are helpful, but there are dangerous ones that need to be stopped. Immunity is a wonderful natural defense system of the human body. It depends on the white cells of the blood to rapidly, rapidly, rapidly get you protected against the disease. Imagine millions of immune cells, like white blood cells, all on the lookout for specific germs. If they spot something dangerous, like flu, they prepare to fight. When that flu bug enters your body, the white cells like to move in on it and they get a bit angry. And in getting angry, they release certain substances that cause inflammation in your body. So you may, in fact, through the immune response alone, feel a little bit uneasy, feel a bit tiny bit unwell, maybe even develop a tiny spike of fever through the immune response, but that's normal. The immune cells arm themselves and then replicate, creating an army of clones. Then, launching powerful germ-killing agents called antibodies, they tag the germs for disposal. Once the germ is removed, the immune army disbands. But they leave behind memory cells. Their job is to remember the invader and to sound the alarm if it ever appears again. One of the most beautiful things is that it's got memory, it remembers. So if you have measles, say, you'll make a strong res immune response against measles. And then if you and the measles virus were to enter your body a second time, you'll mount a much heightened response. You'll work faster. You'll make better quality antibodies. The first time around, it can take at least a week to mount the defense. But next time, the system is prepared. The whole process takes barely a day. It's so fast, we may never have time to feel sick. 